What's up, everybody? JDA here, and we are back with the graphic novels of the week. It's been a while since I've done this, but it's time to get back on track. Let's check out what's out today. Okay, so we have, oh gosh, this is, uh, I need to scooch my screen over a little bit, I think. How come this is not fitting? My browser, oh no, do I have to, there we go. Okay, I have to make my browser a little smaller for you guys. Get this on here. And we get cheapgraphicnovels.com. This is where I go and get the information. We can talk about what's out this week. Here it is, Three Keys Trade Paperback. I am not familiar with this, but that has an art style I'm not into. The Authority Book One. This is a uh, reprint of the Warren Ellis Authority run. I've actually been reading the Stormwatch uh, original issues very slowly uh, before Warren Ellis gets involved in this. I guess they're making an Authority movie or tv show in the new dcu so they're trying to get these back out into circulation i've actually never read this but i have all of it so i will be reading this soon enough avengers all out avengers teachable moment i it's like a kid's version of the avengers blab volume one this is a anthology of cutting edge comics you know oh we've got noah van skyver in here interesting so interesting stuff looks uh looks bizarre black cat social club trade paperback Punk Rock Witches. Oh, gosh. Uh, I'll pass on that one. Booster Gold, Volume 1, uh, 52 Pickup. And I think this is the beginning of uh, his new 52 run, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Something like that. Uh, and the first six issues from there. Cosmic Cadets, Book 1. Uh, this is a space adventure and it looks like modernish type stuff like usual. Not interested. Cosmic Ghost Rider by Donny Cates is back in print once more. It's very popular a few years back. Uh, Deadpool and Cable Omnibus, uh, and this is a reprint of this Omnibus. This was out a while back. There's two different color covers here. Duo hardcover, which is uh, not sure what this is. I don't know. I actually kind of do like this art. EC Archives Tales from the Crypt Volume 3 hardcover. Wait, hardcover? Are they re-releasing this? Or is this soft cover? I know that they've... Uh... Huh. I might be picking this up. I'm I have to take a look at what my tales for the crypt. Uh, <laughs> look at this. We're gonna we're gonna research my collection right now, live on the air. Uh, I should edit this out, but I'm not going to. I have tales from the crypt. Uh, I already have all of tales from the crypt, so I don't need this. I, the, interesting that they're reprinting that. Uh, grab this if you don't have it. <laughs> uh, Fantastic Four by Millar and Hitch Omnibus. Uh, this this was an interesting run that really didn't get a lot of uh, talk at the time. Um, and so this is Millar, Mark, Mill Mark Miller. It's not Millar. I always say that because I've been saying it for my entire life. Uh, but it's a short run also. So I'm going to be grabbing this. I have all this in hardcover already. That means I'm going to have to get rid of my <laughs> lesser versions of it. But I'm excited uh, to have this because I like that whole Fantastic Four era. It's good stuff. Girl from the Other Side of Seal, a run deluxe edition omnibus volume three. Whew. Don't know what this is, but interesting. A land far away, there are two kingdoms. Twisted Beast roams with Curse with a Touch. Interesting. Uh, oh, uh, a Hitler <laughs> graphic novel. Got to be careful with that on YouTube. Judge Dredd Complete Case Files, Volume 41. I've been meaning to like kind of read these. These are like uh, the, the old um, Showcase Presents from DC or old, um, what did they used to do? They, they, weren't Mar they were not Marvel Masterworks. They did a Marvel, uh, prior to the Epic Collections, they did them in black and white, so they're cheap to produce and cheap to read and you could read everything is what they're doing here uh but i've never read any of the judge dread stuff I, I read a couple of stories in a recent 2000 ad compilation that came out but that's it so interesting stuff you'll have to let me know how it is last count of monte cristo i guess this is a retelling uh with speculative fiction i hate that kind of thing midnight sun's trid paperback this is a current event event in marvel queen in comics okay uh, Sap Hunters hardcovers. This looks kind of cool. I like the look of that. Star Wars Timelines art book. Strange Volume 2, Doctor Strange of Death. Uh, Clea's next move. This doesn't look like Doctor Strange. What's happening? Is this current year Doctor Strange? I don't follow the modern stuff. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Best of TMNT Collection Volume 3. I'm not sure what this is either. This is terrible art on the cover. Thor Epic Collection, Even an Immortal Can Die. This is going into uh, some extra stuff. This is Len Wein's uh, run on it for 260 to 280. I always love the Epic Collection, so you know I'll be picking that up. Uh, Vampire Slayer Volume 2. 
and Exterminators, some modern X-Men, yay. Uh, volume uh, trade paperback, so there's that. So of these, my pick of the week is going to be The Fantastic Four by uh, Mark Miller and, uh, of course, Brian Hitch. These are, this is a must pick up uh, for me. And I think that's uh, pretty much it for the week. All right, let me know if you're picking up any of these. Hit the like and subscribe button. Leave a comment down below. We'll be back soon.